Amber Heard's fight with a former partner that happened more than a decade ago was documented in court by a witness as her defamation trial with ex-husband Johnny Depp pulled out. The actress was battling it out in a Virginia court with Depp after he sued her for $50 million over a 2018 op-ed she wrote for the Washington Post. In the op-ed, she also stated that she was a domestic abuse survivor. While Amber Heard, who is countersuing for $100 million, did not name Depp in the article, his attorneys have complained that it was obvious she was suggesting the name of the actor. During the trial, both partners denied each other's allegations of domestic abuse. At the Fairfax County Circuit Courthouse on Wednesday, police officer Beverly Leonard confirmed that she had seen Heard get into an altercation with her former partner, Tazia Van Rie, at a Washington airport. According to Leonard, the incident took place in 2009 at Seattle-Tacoma International Airport, where she was working at the time. Speaking with Depp's lawyer, Camille Vasquez, Leonard said, She was in the baggage claim area when she observed her with a traveling companion. They got into a confrontation where Miss Heard had grabbed her traveling companion and pulled something from her neck. At that point, she got up and went over to try to break up what seemed to be a fight. Tazia then summoned a friend to help her and she stepped in between them and separated them to stop any type of additional injuries or escalation. When asked about Amber Heard and Van Rie's interaction with one another at the time, Leonard said Miss Heard was aggressive toward her traveling friend. She had reached up and pulled her arm and pulled the necklace off of her. And then Leonard observed her having it in her hand. She appeared to not be so steady on her feet and her eyes were blurry and watery and she could also smell alcohol. Of Van Rie, Leonard went on to say, She raised her hands in what seemed to be a defensive posture, but other than that she was quite stoic and didn't really react much. Her reputation was two or three inches taller than Miss Heard, so she didn't really expect to have to defend herself. Vasquez then asked Leonard about Heard's behavior at the time. Leonard then said she was somewhat dismissive. She just said, we're just having an argument. We're fine, we're fine. Because I was asking if they were okay. Are you okay? Is there anything wrong? What's going on? Leonard also claimed that she observed injuries on Van Rie at the time. She said that Van Rie had a bruise on the side of her neck where the necklace was, like a rope burn from the chain as it was removed. If you are liking this content so far, please consider subscribing and liking this video. Now let's continue. Amber Heard also accused Depp's team of planting the allegation in the media that she had been physically abusive toward Van Rie, who was a photographer and artist. Rie was involved in a relationship with the Aquaman star for about five years. Vasquez questioned, you committed domestic violence against Miss Van Rie during your relationship, didn't you? Heard rejected this question while being on the stand. Vasquez asked, You attacked her at a Seattle airport in 2009, didn't you? And people saw that. Amber then responded by saying, That's not true. Depp's lawyer then said that it was covered in the press. Isn't that true? In reply, Heard said, It was planted in the press by Johnny's team, two days after I got the TRO, aka temporary restraining order. Amber Heard and Tazia Van Rie were in a relationship for around five years. They are seen together above at Van Rie's private viewing of distorted delicacies at VS Magazine and Creative Studios Paris Space on June 22, 2011 in New York City. Heard even filed for a restraining order against Depp a few days after filing for divorce in 2016. Their divorce was later finalized in January of 2017. Vasquez questioned, Mr. Depp is not the only domestic partner you've assaulted, is he, Miss Heard? On which Heard said no. Heard and Van Rie argued with each other at the airport in 2009 before she was arrested after hitting her former partner in the arm. Well, Van Rie also issued a statement claiming that the incident was misinterpreted and also that Heard was wrongly accused. Van Rie said in the statement, I recall clues of misogynistic attitudes toward us, which later seemed to be homophobic when they found out we were domestic partners and not just friends. It's disappointing that Amber's integrity and story are being questioned yet again. Amber is a brilliant, honest, and wonderful woman, and I have the ultimate respect for her. We shared five wonderful years together and stay close to this day. 
After being arrested in 2009 by Port of Seattle Police, Heard claimed that the charges were dropped because they knew the exact same thing that she just told everyone, which means that no domestic violence had happened. In Heard's 2016 deposition, which went viral during the current trial, she said, In fact, it was so shocking that those charges, it was a verbal argument, it was misinterpreted and misrepresented. There was no physical violence, no physical abuse, and zero domestic violence whatsoever between us. What are your thoughts on this topic? Let us know your thoughts in the comments section below. With that being said, it's time to end our today's video. Press the like button and subscribe to our channel for more interesting stuff. Peace out!